Hi folks, welcome back to the Covers Witch Shop. This is Arlene once again. I just want you to show you what the eyelids uh, look like, okay? After you paint them, okay? So, uh, after I painted it up, that's exactly what it looks like. And uh, I'm still kind of working on him a little bit yet. I have a little finishing touches to do on him. Just real quick, this, this pattern I do not have on YouTube yet. Um, I may have it in the future. Uh, it's just a little little guy. Actually, this is Jean's method on the bottom, okay? Um, my method <laughs> on the top. So uh, it was his idea. Um, to, and I always wanted to try one of Jean's. I was so busy making uh, tutorials. I thought for once I was going to do something off camera for a change and work on a couple things on my own instead of doing it on the camera. And um, and I will probably end up doing one. It may not look similar to this, but we'll, we'll do something similar to like this in the future. Uh, he's a cute little fella. Um, I think, uh, you know, uh, the Santas are very popular. Um, and it's never too early to do Santas. I know we're just in, in the beginning of March right now. And, uh, but it's never too early. With the Santas that I've done in the past, I always did them from a corner, okay? The face is from the corner. Um, these, um, Gene does his from this side of the block. I do it from this side of the block. So, uh, it worked out really well. Um, and I'm real happy with them. I, I may keep this one just for my own, for my own collection of Santas. A lot of times when you end up carving, you give them away and you sell them and a number of things. But it's a new style for me this year and I think I might stick with it for a little while. Um, you know, the head is always a very important part of the carving, and um, I'll tell you, I, those eyelids aren't difficult to do. It's a very simplistic way to do an eyelid, but it, it worked out pretty good. Okay, folks, thank you very much, and um, I'll have another project going before too long. I'm going to just take a, a tiny break here, and then we'll, we'll be back. Bye-bye.